This is the SoCal Update. I'm Kara Santa Maria. Leaders are pushing to get some of California's most impoverished residents universal basic income. It's Tuesday, June 22nd. Last month, Governor Gavin Newsom proposed a revised budget to allocate $35 million to fund universal basic income pilot programs. The funding is intended to target low-income Californians, and one state senator wants to prioritize agricultural farm workers. Here to give us some insight into the proposal is Melissa Montalvo from the Fresno Bee. Welcome, Melissa. And could you tell us about the proposal and why specifically the focus on farm workers? Of course, Kara. State Senator Melissa Hurtado of Sanger wrote a letter to Governor Newsom asking him to include farm workers for the Universal Basic Income Pilot Program and asked for supplemental guaranteed income for farm workers who have had their hours severely reduced by the drought. Now, these farm workers have already experienced significant loss of work during the pandemic, and now the drought will reduce the amount of land that needs to be farmed, which means a reduction in hours and wages for these farm workers. And days with extreme heat that we're already experiencing here means shorter work days, which means smaller paychecks for farm workers. How many agricultural workers could this affect? The number varies. Um, California is home to an estimated 800,000 farm workers, according to a COVID-19 farm worker study conducted by UC Davis. And roughly 50% of crop workers are thought to be undocumented. However, farm worker advocacy groups think this number could be higher, maybe 60 or 70%. So you know, really the numbers are difficult to pinpoint due to the seasonality and migratory nature of this work. Thanks so much, Melissa. To read more about this report, you can visit calmatters.org.